don't know me yet, my name is Ingrida and welcome to my channel. So this video we're gonna be testing out another product and this one I never heard of a thing like this so this is a super new thing for me, a new brand and new everything. I found this brand called Lottie London in my local super drug in UK. So I'm gonna be testing out the magical magic lipstick. So apparently it's a matte lipstick that turns into the glitter lipstick. Like I personally never heard of a thing like this so we shall try. <laughs> I took in the color Dream On and this brand is apparently cruelty free and pet approved so already massive thumbs up from me. I literally found it accidentally. I never heard of this brand. Have you? Leave a comment down below. Have you tried anything else from this brand? Because this is the first time I hear this. Like, where have I been living? On the rock or what? But anyways, this is a brand new. Have it opened. It's still wrapped in the plastic thingy original package. First of all, it says, read me first if you can see this a camera. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna open it and read it first. Oh, so it says how to use it. First, apply an even coat to the lips. Second, leave to dry for a minute. Third, press the lips together and reveal the glitter magic. Okay, so you apply this on, let it dry so it's completely matte. And if you want to reveal the glitter, you do this like rub on the lips a bit? Is that what they trying to say? I think we should try this on. <laughs> I think we should just test it out and see. Okay, I'm just gonna try to take this plastic bit off. This is the most annoying part for me with any lipstick or any makeup product when they are wrapped in the plastic thing. I think first of all, I should do a swatch on the hand. The color is very, very, very similar. I'm gonna do like a little swatch. Very, very similar to the NYX Lip Lingerie in Exotic or the one by Make Revolution Pro in the color Premonition. If you see, colors are kinda identical. Alright, so I can see a tiny glitter part because I like glided on that, but it's not really glitterish or anything. I can see it inside, but it looks so far mad. I think we should give it a go, leave it to dry and see the glitter. Looks completely dry to me and it looks completely matte as well if you guys can see. So it says to press the lips together that means to rub on like a lippy. I'm gonna try and rub on it to see if we can reveal the magic of a glitter. I feel like it's a little bit too wet still but a glitter is coming up. Oh my god! I mean, it's still a bit wet. It haven't dried yet properly. So I'll need to leave on the lips to dry it a little bit longer. But look at the glitter. Can you see, guys? I really hope you can see this on the camera because what I see in real life. Wow. All right. I think we shall try it on the lips and see. Classic application band. Nothing special in there. Oh, it smells like a watermelon. I'm not a fan of the smell in any of my makeup products. If you follow my channel, you probably know this already, but it smells like a watermelon. Like, honestly, it smells like a watermelon. I like it. Nice. Oh my god, I want a watermelon now. Sounds very nice. It feels very kind of oily. It has kind of oily texture to it. So it glides on the lips really, really, really nice. So, so far, it smells really nice. It smells like a watermelon and I'm not a fan of the smell because sometimes the makeup tends to smell like um, plastic a little bit and annoying, especially if it's a lippy and it's next to your nose. It gets to your head during the day, at least to me. But this one smells like a watermelon, so it makes me hungry. I really want a watermelon now. Like, I can just smell my lips. <laughs> it glides on the lips really easy. Kind of has like a oily texture to it, so it doesn't dry my lips so far. I don't want to rub it on together. Like, so far, it looks perfect perfectly matte, just as it promised, but it's a matte lipstick that magically transforms into glitter. That's why we call it the glitter switch. I'm gonna leave it to dry. It recommends to leave it to dry for a minute. I'm gonna give it two or three minutes, so for sure it's gonna reveal the glitter. So I'm gonna see you soon. Alright guys, the moment of truth. I left to dry the lipstick for, uh, I would say, five minutes. So it's completely dry for sure. My lips feels very dry, so it's not the most comfortable lipstick to wear so far. But maybe when we're gonna reveal the glitter, it will feel nice on the lips. I tried to reveal the glitter and see if it really works, because so far I don't think so, but I hope I'm gonna prove myself wrong, so let's do it. 
I think it's made for the reason to be sticky so you can reveal that glitter and I can already see so this one has like a golden glitter in it I've seen in the shop different colors and all and I think some of them were more like a silver tone in it but I really really love this dream on color my lips are super glittery now I mean all right so my lips are not stick anymore so I think they specially made the lipstick to be stick at first so it will stick lips and reveal that glitter probably because it's not stick anymore I mean look at that can you see because at first when it was all matte and the glitter wasn't revealed it was super super sticky and it felt super dry in the lips but now it feels amazing it's not dry anymore the most bizarre lipstick ever i tried in my life like literally honestly i never tried anything like this i'm gonna try and give it a water challenge to see how transferable it is and if it's gonna leave any mark on my water glass um there's no mark whatsoever can you see yay this is so bizarre it was it felt uncomfortable while it was matte it felt very like dry plus it felt sticky you know like i wanted to put my lips together kind of like to moisturize it but now after i did it after i pressed my lips together and revealed that glitter and it's super sparkly i really do hope you guys can see this on the camera it feels amazing on the lips I really hope you guys can see how sparkly my lips looks because what I see in the mirror is like super glittery. I am loving this. I thought I'm gonna hate it when I just applied and it felt very dry when the matte effect dried off. But after revealing a glitter, oh my freaking goodness. And this is transfer proof as well. So, hello, wait, is it not true? Oh, nothing sucks on at all. I am loving this. Could I recommend more? Honestly, go get yourself a magical lipstick that is matte and glitter in one. So I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and you find this helpful. If so, please, please, please don't forget to press the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more. <laughs> and I can't wait to share more videos with you guys and I'll see you very, very soon. So thank you so much for watching and bye. Ciao guys.